demonstrations against the South African government's strict apartheid policies flare into shocking violence. At Sharpsville, an industrial township, thousands gather outside a police station in protest against new laws requiring every African to carry a pass at all times. The crowd refused to disperse and began stoning the police, who opened fire into the crowd from behind a wire fence. In two days of demonstrations that began here, between 50 and 100 were killed and hundreds injured. Worldwide protests were raised including a condemnation of the violence by the United States State Department. In South Africa, a mass work boycott by Africans is crippling industry in the area. An uneasy calm reigns. The conditions that led to the Sharpsville tragedy continue unchanged.